and they'd be like, nah, man, I, I got four, but I'm waiting for someone off the court. And you got me? Yeah. They're like, nah, nah, I'm waiting for somebody. I'm like, damn, yeah. fuck these niggas, man. So then I finally get on the court and I be, I'll be washing them. I really be literally wearing, wearing <laughs> this it. shit right here with pants. With Nabisco on your shirt. Yeah, Nabisco. <laughs> I'll be wearing this with pants. Like, you got me, man? Hey, yo, can I, can yeah, I hoop? Can I run with you? Can yeah, I run? Yeah, like, no, we don't, we don't here? know. We don't know, huh? <laughs> come back later. Yeah. And then you come out there and just start blazing. That's yeah, crazy. Shooting, out there shooting pull up 23 footers, knocking them down the court short. Man, yeah, I know people I, hate you, man. Yeah, I, be, yeah, they they get mad, I, be, I believe that. Is, yo, is, that oh, is that the equivalent of wearing two tank tops and a pink baseball cap backwards? <laughs> Not no YouTube shit. And I ain't painting my <laughs> no, fingernails like that nigga from Duke. No, that's uh, white, white man, man can't, can't jump. jump. Thank yeah. you. Yeah, okay, there you go. My bad, my yeah. bad. We going to Sizzler. We going to Sizzler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> hold on, hold on. But, <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Everybody, welcome to the Abyss Podcast. You know what I'm saying? A uh, couple announcements first. Uh, rest in peace to DJ Mr. C. You know what I'm saying? Are you uh, going to say it with a smirk passed. on your face, Luke? I didn't smirk. Hey, you yo, had, bro, you had a smirk. I chill, saw the smirk. Chill. Chill out, Carl. Chill, man. Chill, bro. Chill, mm. man. Rest in peace the legendary Mr. C. If y'all are familiar, he DJed for a Biggie. Uh, I think it's the Wicked Freestyle. Talking about chlamydia and shit. Uh, fucking Biggie Small. This is a legendary. You know, remember that shit? He said, "I fuck you up like chlamydia, gonorrhea." That that legendary freestyle. Uh, DJ Mister C. You know what I'm saying? Rest in peace to Mister C. Also big Daddy DJ. Kane's DJ. A lot of people. He was he was a legendary. A lot of people. Like mm-hmm. yeah, he was on Hot 97. Am I correct? Right. Mm-hmm. Uh yeah 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 all that shit. Primo Jab. Uh, we got to meet him right on the on the on the Rock the Bells boat. Yeah yeah absolutely. Swim and D. Shout sure out to He's cool, dude. Swim and D. Uh, Carl, how you doing, bro? Doing really, really well. Rocking my uh, Abyss hoodie. Dave Proach and I shout out Dave Proach for uh, we're talking about doing something special for the 150th episode. So. Yeah, it's right around the corner, y'all. Mm-hmm. Boom, boom, boom. Mm-hmm. And I see, yeah, uh, closer. I, yeah, yeah. And I see a Primo Jack got the uh, Crime Apple joint on. Quebec. My tech. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's man, the man Tekka, Tekka the, the, the Moet flavored man Tekka joint. Trim and D, yeah, nice. Trim and D, Trim and D. But we had a really special guest here at the building, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to take no more time so we can get to talk to this brother right here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, he hails from Delaware? Delaware, correct, you man. Get it? Delaware. You, you, I said, I said, I said it like building, that. Man. I said it like that. You know what I'm saying? I'm a, I'm a dad. I'm a dad, you know what I'm saying? Hey, Delaware, Dover, Delaware. Yeah, 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 yeah. Dover, yeah. Delaware, 302 in the building, man. 302. I know y'all. Oh, wait. Let me get it again. Maskeen Halim is in the building with us. You know what I'm right. saying? Welcome. Boom, 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 Welcome. boom, boom. Yeah. Well, so you were there. Two, 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 two and D. Two and D. Boom, 302 spitters. Man. Shout out to you, bro. Best, man. We here, mm-hmm. man. Appreciate you, know, you, man. 302 spitters. Uh, let's go into la- to, like the Delaware scene and like how you like got brought up on this shit. You know what I'm saying? Man, I mean, I've, I've, been, rap- I've been rapping for a minute. You know what I'm and uh, I'm, I'm actually from I'm actually from the same city as uh, a, a, a couple couple solid dudes, man. Uh, I don't know if y'all heard of the Mobilari, J Nice, Left yeah, yeah, yeah. Lane, J Nice, yeah. of course, yeah, the, uh, all the, the dumpers, RC. the dumpers, yeah. yeah, we yeah we all we all we all from the same city, man. So uh, you know, I've I've been moving and grooving for a little minute. I I first started like. Officially in 20, 2019, 2018, okay. you feel me? Man, I just, I, mean, I just, just kept mashing, man. That's what I was going to say, man. Um, it's shout out, first of all, shout out all them dudes that you named, but y'all came up kind of as a bumper crop out oh, of shit. Delaware, like really just smashing y'all way in and putting it on, on the map essentially. But not only that, like during the time that 2019 era, when you were coming out, like you were one of them names along with Ice Lord, mm-hmm. uh, like Sully Nomad, um, who else? Uh, yeah, Supreme Cerebral, 
uh, Ralphie Reese and them, like like one of the these Dark foundational, mm-hmm. yeah, the Dark Unit, all praise due to them brothers. But yeah, one of the <laughs> foundational kind of names that was out here when this thing was coming back to life, when it was really catching its its wind, man. Like you were right there on the forefront. You were putting out material, and you're saying that's like when you were just starting. Yeah, right. Twenty nine, like twenty nineteen. That's when I had a uh, I dropped Black History, and then uh, Rob Demare, right? that, you know. Right. Shout out to him, man. I, I seen y'all had him on there too. That's a dope interview. Mm-hmm. Uh I had a I had a joint with Mew One too. You know what I'm saying? A rare form Genesis. You know what I'm saying? Those like those two was like my first official like that that was that was like my introduction into the whole underground thing. You hit you know the like, running. Like, yeah. I did. Yeah. I did. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't you can't play with it if you if you gonna do it, do you you know. I do it. Yes. True indeed. True indeed. I will yeah, came in contact, I think it was in twenty twenty one or twenty twenty twenty. I think it's twenty twenty. Uh Mondo. That's why I was really getting into Mondo heavy. Uh yeah. yeah. So I like, yeah, you know you yeah. how you connect the dots with Slave, man. Yeah, Slave, yeah, man. Slave, yeah. Yeah, Slave has been one of my favorites for a minute. So you connect the dots. So and then like boom, there you go. Like, <laughs> yeah. You find somebody else dope. Know what I mean? So that's that's how that happened occurred. But boom, you um been rapping for a long time. Same mm-hmm. city as some of the dumpers. You know what I'm saying? You always explain your name. Is that your 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 God given name? Your your the what what do you No, so, no Meskin Meskin Halim is is my attribute. You know what I'm saying? I'm a Muslim. You know what I'm True saying? Name. So Halim so Halim is actually an attribute of Allah. You know what I'm saying? So mm-hmm. When when like when I refer to myself as Halim, it's actually Abdul Abdullah Halim. Mm. You know what I'm saying? But the like that that that's that's, that's the head. You know what I'm saying? The mesquite. You know what I'm saying? That means poor. You know what I'm saying? That that mean that means the less fortunate. Like you remember the clothing mm. brand mesquite, right? Yes. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That, that's that's derived from the term masking. You know what I'm saying? So the 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 masking is one. The mesquite is like a whole, you know what I'm saying? And, and those was given to me by a brother of mine. Mm. And shout out to him from Germantown, man. You know, like, like, though, like, though, like the names got to be given to you. You know what I'm saying? You can't just like, like, though, like, right. They, right. Yeah. right they, they supposed to be qualities like that, like that's within you. You feel me? Right. So, indeed. So, uh, so yeah, the, the, like the mesquite, man, like, you can't you you can't you can't take like you can't take none of this with you when you go. Yeah, you know I'm saying so. You like you can have it all right now, but in the end, you gonna die like you gonna die with nothing. You know what I'm saying you're going out with nothing. You know what I'm saying so like that's 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 me. Bro, bro. Mm. that's tough right there, yo. Go ahead, man. Uh, yeah, my man. Uh, go ahead. Yeah, come no, I was just that. going. I was just going to shout him out. Uh, you know, salute to you and um, I guess what is it? Uh, congratulations on completing Eid. Isn't that something yeah, that's just day. Mm-hmm. It's today. It's today, right? Yeah, that would be today, today. right? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. Today, uh, today, you know, was the end of the, the month of Ramadan. Yes. You know the what I'm saying? So now, April. Right. So now we're going into the month of Shawal. So, you know, at the end, like everybody just come together, you know, meet at the masjid. You know what I'm saying? Break bread uh, for yeah. the prayers. You know what I'm saying? Listen, yeah. That, but that's today, though. So indeed. It's beautiful. It's, it's beautiful, man. It's a glorious day, right? Yeah. It, it, it is. You know what I'm saying? Indeed. Like, 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 the, like the whole month. You know what I'm saying? Like, you, you know, when, 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 when you, when you really dig into it, like you, you see, like, like, like where you need to go from there, man. Because, like, you, you know, like, it, you, 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 your brain is taught. Like, you know what I'm saying? You, 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 you clear. You know what I'm saying? You, you get a, you get a clear understanding of what you need to leave off. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like physically and mentally, you feel me? Like, like the it's whole money is cool, man. Like an unfiltered you know what I'm saying? perspective. What's, what's, uh, I think, I, I think the word is refinement. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And like, like, like you, they like, get refined, man. So indeed, uh, no, a couple of my uh, guys at work, you know what I'm saying? They, uh, every time the last day of Ramadan, they, they call out, they, they, they're not coming to work. It's, it's time for celebration The time. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You know a couple of basketball players that, uh, participate in as well. I know Kyrie, 
Mm-hmm. Did Ram- does Ramadan every year? You know, Elijah wanted hey. to as well. That, 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 right, right. We, I, we on we on the same wave, like, bro. That's exactly what I was about to say. He, he made that left handed oh, shot doing Ramadan. Mm-hmm. That was probably one of the greatest shots. And uh, and a ten out of ten difficulty, a left handed jumper at the three point line on the run over a a seven foot. <laughs> So he wasn't, he wasn't at the three point line. That was the goal. He was in between. He was in between the three, the free throw <laughs> the, line the, and the, the high point. school, the high school three point line. I'm, okay. I'm going to say. All right. During okay. Ramadan, where well, you didn't eat or drink until the sun went down. Yeah. Woo! That is no, a, that's, yeah, hey, that's listen, a like, yeah. it's, it's like you got to you got to refrain from a lot. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, mm-hmm. it's, it's it's you know it's it's real, man. You know what I'm it's saying? Real. Like. You know, you you some people get it confused where I right, you might not be committing the same with your hands. You know what I'm saying? But you could be committing one with your eyes, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Or 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 like what you say or like what you say, you feel me? So mm-hmm. like it, right. you know, you gotta like you gotta really get in tune with like if you know, it if, if if that's what you want. You know what I'm saying? I mean that I like, at, at least all the Muslims I know that that's that's what they want, man. So indeed, yeah, you know I'm saying the- like this, yeah, all the blessings you can. So indeed, mm-hmm. I remember Sheikh Sheikh Hanif came on the show and said that it's he was easy for him to be on his dean when he was locked up. When he got out, that's what it was like it was like a super tough time. I think he did a dime. Yeah. I think a, a, he mm-hmm. did a very long time. He came out said, "Yo, it's it's really tough." So yeah, uh, yeah. Oh, and they, right before Ramadan, my homie Sada he said, "Nobody in here piss me off because it's Ramadan." I was like, I get it. I got it. The next day, he was quiet. You know what I'm saying? But uh, he's been doing it since a child, since he said, like, his his parents made him do it when he was eight years old. Like, mm-hmm. So he's been trained, and it was nothing for him. But he was quiet. He chose his words properly. Today, he called out. So shout out to everybody out there, uh, all my Muslim brothers and sisters in Islam. Shout was, out uh, to uh, yeah, Umar, going man. To, yeah, shout out did, to yeah. True indeed, true indeed, man. You just had an album come out today as well, huh? You know what I'm saying? I did. I did. True indeed. Well, the unlimited. 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 I don't know. I don't yeah. know if y'all can see it. Yeah, man. I was noticing the fresh but, shirt. True indeed. Yeah, shout out to shout out to True Heads, man. Yo, he, yes, he dope. Y'all got y'all got to tap in with him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I didn't know True he, Heads, he, live, man. I ain't know he produced. Fire, man. That? I ain't oh, know he did. Yeah. I, he made the artwork and he produced the whole entire thing, huh? He did. He did. That, that's what I'm saying. Triple threat, yeah. man. I, no, du- dual threat. You know what I'm saying? I don't think he rat. Yeah. You know <laughs> yeah, there you go. He probably do, probably do low key, though. <laughs> you never know. So indeed. You know what I'm saying? Hey, 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 Was he from Canada? He's from Canada? Yeah, he from mm-hmm. uh, Man- Man- yeah, Manitoba. Correct. Oh, oh wow. yeah, Manitoba. Oh, I, think, cool. I, I think, yeah, yeah. I, I think that's like Winnipeg, like over there by Winnipeg or something. Yeah, like, yep. I don't, West. Don't, don't get me wrong. Yeah, it's cold, bro. Yeah, yeah, it's mm-hmm. up there. Boom, boom, boom. It's crazy, man. I remember, uh, okay, boom, yeah, boom. Yeah, that, that dropped today, though, man. So, indeed. April 10th, because this Yeah, we're in the when. future right now, it's, it's, so it's it's already out. You know, everybody should have been spinning it a couple of times, man, listening to to the domination of uh, nothing <laughs> ill, nothing man. but ill fly, fly talking. <laughs> And you know, putting people in their place, yeah. man. That's what's that's what's going on, man. Yeah, that real, jerk, real primo jab rap action. That hey. jerk, primo jabs on a song, domination. Yeah, well, I, appreciate, I appreciate that no look too, man. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Hey, certain shit, certain certain shit ain't for the squeamish. You hear me? <laughs> you understand? You for understand? Real. You know, don't, yeah. don't you don't want to see how the sausage get made? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> man. Back. Yeah. I'm you. But, but, yeah. Tell us a little bit about this album, man. Like the uh concept behind it. And I know you did an interview with uh True Heads a long time ago. Well that I long did. ago. Yeah, and then um It was yeah. about about three years ago. Mm-hmm. Wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Tell tell us about it, man. Tell mm-hmm. us a little bit about how the process of this. I didn't know he was producing. Man. I don't know. Yeah. You know, I um uh, I went to school for a little bit, came, you know, got out of got out of school, hollered at him, you know, got got back into the groove of the social media. And uh he was like, yo, bro, I I, I got something about to send you. You know what I'm saying? So I was actually working on something else at the other like, I was 
actually working on something else. You know what I'm saying? So I'm 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 just in the lab, like just zoning out. You know what I'm saying? Me and my man, and then that beat came on. And I was I was like, oh. You know what I'm saying? So we did chapters of a true master. That was that was the first joint we did. Mm-hmm. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And that 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 just that just set it up. You know what I'm saying? He's like, yo, I'm about to send you a pack. So over time, you know, I just put it together. You know, just connected the dots and you know, I I was like, all right, it's, you know, it's certain people that I respect that I ain't I ain't, you know, we ain't splash yet. So, you know, that's when Jabbo came in the mix. You know what I'm saying? Got that out the way. Domination, drop that. You know, Spoda through Spoda in the yeah, mix yeah. On, like mm-hmm. that we, just, we, we, we just yeah, that yeah, that consistency, man. Like consistent, yeah. Uh, like all these, all these guys is like consistent with it, man. You know what I'm saying? Like that, like that's that's what I love. So like over time, man, we just put it together, and you know we would have been dropped it, but you know the month of Ramadan came, so I I sat on it for a minute. You know what I'm saying? And hit y'all with it. You know what I'm saying? I hit the people with it. You know what I'm saying? But like it is, it's different, man. You know, I I try to hit all pockets, man. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't just rap the same every time. Like you gotta Yes. You know, I, there's a variety in there. Yeah, exactly. You know what I'm saying? So we here yeah. with it. True indeed. Like the other album you yeah, dropped yeah. this earlier this year, the Polo Project with uh straight bangers. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um that's Man, a I dropped that. conscious. What? Yeah, I, I dropped that actually uh twenty 20- 19, I think. Oh, what, this is an older, oh, this is an older joint. Mm-hmm. We just put it on yeah. all platforms. Okay, okay. We just okay. put it on all yeah. platforms recently. Yeah, because Straight Bangers yeah, got a lot of... Yeah, that's an old project, too. Yeah, he got a lot of uh, stuff with... Um, I think I sit with Sky Zoo and some other niggas and shit, yeah. They were. Like, he yeah, really... Yeah. He, they, 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 they really deal with the boy... Uh, what's his name? Babgate. Oh, remember, Babgate? Remember, remember, remember Babgate? Yeah, 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 they 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 got a, they got a lot of work with him. So indeed, I I haven't really mm-hmm. kept up with Bathgate. I mean, he had a video come out a long time ago, and the album never dropped. <clears throat> uh, I forget what label label was on. Bro, they they got they got they got some credits, man. Like like straight bangers, man. They 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 got some, you know they they got a nice little catalog, man. Like they 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 own that straight bangers, man. Uh, it's two of them, right? I'm not even sure. I didn't, I didn't even know. I just knew it knew it was just uh, uh, uh I didn't know it was two people, G. Yeah, I thought it was just I, one I, person to be honest yeah, with I, you. I, I, no, I, I think I, I think it's two of them. If I if I'm I ain't mistaken, but right they made the Polo project, man. They they did they think with the beats on that one, man. That that is a dope project. True indeed, true indeed. I'm saying it was more of a uh, conscious type of album. To me, well, actually, when it starts out, you know what I mean? So when yeah. you, and I remember you saying you don't want to rap on it. Yeah. And I know you say you don't like to uh, rap the same way. I'm a, definitely a fan of people who uh, rap what the beat calls for. You know what I'm saying? True so indeed. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. You just don't go in there and just do whatever. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Also, uh, you produce an LG? Man, I, I I put I put a couple beats together, man, but I only only uploaded one. I did. Yeah, the Hollywood beat. Yeah. Yep. That's just kind of fire, what man. What you use to make that? Yeah, that's just fire, bro. That's that's man. man that's, that's that's my style right there, G. Yeah, yeah. It's it's not boom bapish. It's low key to me on the more experimental side, but but friendly. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like it's not gonna it scare is. off. It's not gonna scare off the niggas. <laughs> you know what I mean. Yeah, right, right. but so some people if it gets too spacey, they'd be like, "What the fuck is this shit?" But that shit was like, it's like right there. You know what I'm saying? Like, I love shit like that. Being a doomhead, know what I mean. <laughs> I appreciate that, man. Uh, my boy threw me a pack. You know what I'm saying? He threw me a pack, and I like just bored playing around. Made that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? It, like, it wasn't. It was. I ain't. I ain't do too much to it. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? I, I I just started out getting a feel for it. You know what I mean? Is it something you're interested but, uh, in pursuing, though? It is. It nice. is. 
I'm telling you, like, I, I got, I got an ear. I got an ear, man. I, I got, a, I got a hell of an ear, man. Like, that's what I'm saying. As, as far as music I make, you know what I'm saying? I, I try to, I try to use samples that nobody else used. Cause like, it was, it was a point in time where people was just like re, like recycling the same samples. Yes, like, I, yes. I heard and sometimes I heard cutting it, it the here. same way. Yeah. Yeah. I heard, I heard over here. I heard it over here. Oh, they just got on to it. So I like, now nah, they got it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, nah, I gotta, you know, I, I gotta, you know, learn, learn how to do that stuff myself. You feel me? Mm-hmm. So, but yeah, that, that's, that's definitely something I'll pursue, man. I'm, I'm telling you, like, you know, and then, and, and due time, in due time, we're going we to see, man. I got, a, yeah, I got that, a good yeah. question for you, my bro. I got a question. So, I'm going to start a little bit of a, a mess. Why not? It's early. What do you feel like are the top <laughs> five songs that have been sampled to death that you hear all the time? You know what I mean? In in your your travels, right? The ones that you're like, oh, man, I can't believe somebody's doing this again. In, anytime you instantly hear and it's always cut the same way. You know what I mean? You said that you said the top five. Yeah. Yeah. Give me give me five. Man. Give me five joints that just anytime you hear it you like it again it's like dang you couldn't go further down the the trough to get it better joint off than that it's the i is it the islies you know what i mean is it a james brown joint it's yeah, two, you know, a couple it's two. couple couple al greens couple al greens uh it was a, it was that's that's one it was a john that rizzo used i think it was uh Da-da. simply beautiful Da-da. Man, it it was, was actually it in that movie. It was actually in that. I think it's like an Ann Peebles sample or something like that. Okay. You ever seen that? You ever seen that movie Three Days to Kill? Well, uh, we, we, I, I think I think it was Bruce Willis. They played Three. that joint in the beginning. Uh, okay. Those, those two. Uh, Man, it's, it's, a, it's a couple more, but I can't, I can't, I, I gave you two, Jay. I gave you a solid two. That, yeah, that, 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 was, that, hey, that's a, that was, that was a weird off the cuff question, but it just yeah, made me think about it. Cause I was like, Kevin Costner. You know, there were yeah, a yeah, lot yeah, of yeah, people. Yeah, 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 right, right. I, I said Bruce Willis. Oh, that's what I, yeah. was in it. Yeah. Amber Heard. Yeah, but, uh, oh, Amber they, Heard was in it? Okay. Ooh, Johnny Depp. Ooh. X. Abuser. Yeah. Hey, yo, I, I got one for y'all though. You know, remember the uh overnight celebrity joint by yeah, Twister? Of course. Uh then Mob Deep sample that a lot of people sample that same um that same joint right there. Yeah. Yeah. Then the when did Mob Deep uh, use it? Uh on the not the not the infamous Infamy. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah Infamy did have a couple of uh yeah. Reuse songs place. like that. I guess you could oh, yeah, okay. I mean, in the Isley's in between the sheets, Isley's in between the sheets. A lot of commercial joints, Isley's yeah, in between yeah. tweets. But Dilla did it the best. You ask me. You know, I know you hate Jay Dilla. Uh, you know, Jay. Yeah, yeah. yeah but I, I, as a segue <laughs> to saying, I know one of your influences, uh, Maskeen, is Tupac. I am not a really big Tupac fan for the fact that I feel like he rapped the same way every song, like little like little mm. brother. Interesting. Rapped the way. Uh, every song so that's what really kind of made me not really n- not appre- appreciate the flow the man definitely loved him i love some music from him but i wasn't the hugest tupac fan you know what I'm saying? I get that. I, yeah 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 I, I, I thought he rapped the same like little brother rapped the same way every song g i still liked it <laughs> i mean but, now it, it is it is it is some some exceptions to rap and sing yeah, you know I'm saying, and I and I say that to say this, like, as long as, as long as the content there, you know, what I'm saying, like, like as long like you could rap the same had like what, what's the delivery like? I mean, the delivery like you feel me? So that that's why I say Pac, like, yeah, he 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 might have rapped the same like I I know what you're talking about. You talking about like the hand the is in the memory. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Right, I know, right. I know so what you're talking yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I fucks with it, but it's, yeah. 
I mean, he ain't do that all I, the I time. Think, no, though. those I are think, just the I, most impactful ones that you can remember. Look, that's, you know, what I mean, like those are the style. signature ones. Yeah, that's a that's style. His, that was a part of his style. But you can't tell me, dear mama, is the same as hit him up or as <clears throat> um, you know. I I mean, it, he definitely had different flows. There were just some signature sounds that made Tupac right. sound like Tupac. Right. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. And I think people confuse that like he had this cut and paste style of rapping. It wasn't that. Yep. I agree with that, uh, Carl. Yeah, but still, I wasn't really a big fan. You know what I'm saying? Boy, I just wasn't. You know what I'm saying? But once again, I've never listened to a J. Cole, Drake, or Kendrick Lamar song on purpose. So there's a lot of music out there that I just didn't really. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. I, just, I, mean, I, just, yeah. I just say this like, as far as music as a whole, like, I, I ain't never really been like on, on mainstream. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, talking, mm. I'm talking about like like since a kid. Mm. You know what I'm saying? I I've been on like while while everybody was bumping uh Biggie and and all that, I was on like the War Report, like Core Mega and stuff like oh, that. Oh yeah, okay. You know what I'm saying like I I wasn't I wasn't I I quit like it, it, I I can't get with the mainstream at all like that. You know what I'm saying? Like some of my first tapes, like one of my first tapes was the War Report. You know what I'm saying? My older cousin, my older cousin had it. You know what I'm saying? I I made my folks go to the store get it for me from the mall. It was like that Sam Vinny Mac. Hopped in the wheel. Driver's seat was my favorite. Yeah. Like, oh yeah. I used to love driver's yeah. seat. Channel mm-hmm. Ten. Um. You know, obviously L A L A. Um. Yeah, man. Yeah, it had a bunch of joints on there, man. Um, but yeah, definitely driver's seat. Driver's seat was whew. That is he my thug. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he slept on he slept on too, Jed. Yeah, he my thug is nice. I I like him. No, that's that dude, man. Definitely. That's that dude. I agree. I agree. Shout out Tragedy Gaddafi. Shout out the whole twenty five life dudes. Yeah, you know. I don't know if y'all know this, but uh my first tape I got was uh Shaq Diesel. <laughs> oh wow, really? Hey man, hey, he he had a couple of joints on there. I had so that tape. Shaq can rap. Yeah, we ain't gonna Thank hate. You. Nobody's gonna hate on Jack you. Can rap. Thank what, you Shaq what, CD? what about you though, Jack? Who, who, who was your first tape, Jack? Oh shit, my, my first tape was The Great Adventures of Slick Rick. Oh yeah, definitely yeah. But but didn't have shoot you, slam on that shit. Um, you want me to shoot it? So I'm no. I'm super old. Um. <laughs> Damn, I don't even know. Cause like I came up, I'm I'm I, I turned fifty one yesterday. Oh so, man, to a D. Yeah, happy so, belated, man. Thank you, thank call, you. Call um, me it's 51. a celebration. So, I mean, like the first concert I ever went to was a Holland Oats concert. Like you know, I oh, I was wow. into everything. Yo, they, they Van it. Halen. Holland Holland Oats is dope, bro. They, oh they no no no! I'm not saying I I'm not ashamed that I went. I I'm just <laughs> saying like. My my musical diversity as a kid was was really broad, like mm-hmm. everything from you know Run DMC <clears throat> and Grandmaster Flash to you know Cindy Lauper and you know Duran Duran to Van Halen and Alice Cooper. Like I listened to all kinds of different stuff when I was coming up. So um, it wasn't until I really started into like skateboarding when Public Enemy like really started taking off. That's when I really like just dove into being like a hip hop head, hip hop head. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, so that was like, you know, I was a huge EPMD fan. Um, I remember, you know, when I picked up strictly business on tape, um, mm-hmm. you know, I just like, I don't know. Like I, 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 I always collected a lot of different stuff back then. We used to get Paytel records would have compilations and mm. so you'd get a compilation record and it'd be like um you know it'd have like a train like a locomotive on the front of it or something and then on the back of it it'd have like 15 tracks and they were all different artists from like different different genres and stuff and that's how we got introduced to stuff <laughs> really early on oh, that's yeah, cool. thank you. like a label compilation essentially yeah yeah gotcha okay a real record though <laughs> mm-hmm. yep vinyl that should be on Discogs for fifteen thousand dollars. You know what I'm saying? Word. I'm gonna tell you what though. Uh, thinking about it, like yeah, you know that 
that slick Rick thing, that was when I was young, you know, a little whippersnapper. But the first time I was really like really fully enamored in this thing, I think I can say it was probably getting uh Ice Cube the uh death certificate. Death yeah. certificate, yep. Death and certificate. lethal injection. I and then I lethal the injection and then predator. All three yep. of those together was But even was America's a most time. wanted was Yeah, but no, that amazing. was I'm, that was that, yeah, was, that just was before dope, you were kind of. That was just before, yeah. right? That was my just before. But then that whole Ice Cube run right there, that was man, that was it. That was my, I was a huge Ice Cube dude. You know, what I mean, definitely. And then yeah. the Chronic, you know, the I I played the Chronic back to front uh, so many damn times. That was a game changing like, album. The the Chronic was just, I mean, it took over when it came out, man. That was the Chronic. Hey quick story real quick right i never forget it bro i went over my grandparents crib to eat right so i had two tapes in my pocket i had the chronic and i had 36 chambers right yeah i yeah i i listen i sat i sat him on the counter my grandfather looked at him and took him he's like like he's like oh nah you can't yeah it's the devil yeah i'm like man yeah, swipe, swipe, swipe my tapes, man. Had me hot. I was a kid, so though. Like, never like got that was back. actually around the time like they came out, too. You never yeah, can. You can't never got them back, right? Never got them back. Bro, Damn. you hate that? Is your Damn. father, did, is your grandfather that took them? Yep. He's a religious, huh? He's like, yo, like. <laughs> oh, it, it, it wasn't even that. I mean, I, I guess it was the age factor. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay, I was yeah, a kid. Yeah. That's real. You know what I'm saying? So, 93. I was yeah, eight years old. I was eight like, years old. I was in third grade. The, the Chronic the, the chronic came out before uh, 36. I think The yes, Chronic was like 92. Did. The Chronic you know came out in like the kind of the fall, winter of 92. Yeah, and then 36 Chambers, uh, Illmatic, uh, Midnight, Mar- Midnight Mar- Marauders, Mar- Marauders, Hard to Earn, all that came out literally like the next, oh, the next like, Six mm-hmm. months. It was a and ill you're time. And you're forgetting Shaq Diesel came out too, and that was the only hip hop my dad would let me get. Hey, look, hold on, man. Shaq. Why you why you bringing up Shaq, man? Shout out Lords of the Underground. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? Oh, yeah. I don't think they get enough props. They deserve they deserve props, man. Shout out Lords of the Underground, man, because they yeah, had Shaq, man. they they took Shaq out there and was like, yeah, we we gonna rock with you, Shaq, just off the strength of Jersey. But mm-hmm. I mean, they they definitely and shout out Das Effects. Because yeah, I mean, effects had the, the game in a headlock, but you're you're talking about an era where Yo MTV Raps was yeah. was giving us like brand new bangers every week, every yeah, all the you time. Know, I remember like when Far Side first came out, and I'm like, what yeah. the hell is this? Like, you know, there were just it was it it kind of you know it reminds me. <clears throat> a lot of what's going on now just with so many dope releases happening all the time you know it's not on a mainstream media stance but when you know you know it's just as exciting now as it was back then in the early 90s when just hit after hit after hit was coming out naughty by nature and queen latifah no. was dropping and you know you had um yeah. i just yeah it was it was a crazy Trash was the man for for quite some time and, and it was because of MTV um, and not only Yo! MTV Raps but Tretch and Naughty by Nature were the crossover band of hip hop for a long time or they had an era let me not say a long time but they had an era when they were yeah. they were the ones when they came out on stage they like, dropped an anthem everybody was going crazy oh they hip-hop dropped several hooray. anthems but hip hop yeah. hooray was yeah hip hop hooray it, of course it, it was one of those things is. where it was like yeah, I just I don't care who you were. If it came yep. on, everybody was into it. Yeah, the hook. Man, same as OPP. Yep. OPP All was another super. one of them ones. But yeah, yeah definitely hip hop array. Muskeen's grandpa and uh, my dad would have took all them tapes from us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, uh, he only uh, he yeah. only got them two, man. He only he only got those two. That's yeah, right. I got so much. My dad got so much after that. that. Yeah, that's right. My, my dad ran over a Jay Z dynasty with the car, the CD. Oh wow! Yeah, it didn't break though. He don't know that it didn't break because it's in the case. Yeah. The, so it, the jewel case cracked, 
Right. Now, I got. I went into the trash can and got that shit. That's when they started getting them big ass trash cans. I was like, man, hope I don't get ringworm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That was yeah. that was the disappointment though of of that whole parental advisory era. You know, mm-hmm. when 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 they started mandating the parental advisory, it was like a warning sign to parents. It didn't matter what it was, just they can't listen to it because it has that label. Mm-hmm. But that label was also the reason you really wanted to find out what was on that album too. Of course. Like it was a huge selling point. So indeed. So indeed. So boom, you went to school for a minute, you know what I'm saying? And you came back, you're coming mm-hmm. back, you're coming back with a vengeance, know what I mean? Word. Man, just, you know, just splashing, man. You know, just putting it out there, man. Like I can't I, I, I can't even put it in the words, man. Like I'm I'm just going. You know, you just, just just going, slant, staying low and firing off. Um True indeed, man. Uh, man that's that's something I always you know? kind of noticed about you and always respected about you anyway, bro, is that you you definitely seem like just a dedicated to making it happen dude, you know, even before school and then until now, till after that, man. Like, you know, I'm glad that you hit the ground running and really are just taking advantage of every opportunity, man, because people were definitely missing you. And they were looking for you. I'm glad you got to, you know, send us a couple of, you know, a couple of updates here and there. You know what I mean? But yeah, now you're back. And it's, you know, like I said, it's domination time, you know, show them, show yeah. them exactly what it's about, man. For sure that, man. I appreciate that, man. Yes, you sir. know what I'm saying? The same to you, man. You know, like skill, recognize skill. That's my slogan. You feel me? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's a, re- it's a reason we here, man. You mm-hmm. know what I'm no, saying? That's a like, fact. I'm, I'm I'm telling you, you know, but as 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 far as the rap thing go, you know, it, it it's it's always going to be around. Yeah, you know I'm saying I feel like my 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 music meant for who it's meant for. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? I, every like everything ain't for everybody. You feel me? So I like, but I, I understand that. So I I you know I I know how to maneuver. You know what I'm saying? Just like. You know, I'm 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 just I'm I'm just putting my story out there, you feel me? I ain't I ain't got too many skills. You know what I'm saying? Some people can right. excuse me, some some people can work with their hands. You know what I'm saying? I, I didn't I didn't I didn't learn no skill. You know what I'm saying? So like I was I was I was blessed with a voice, so I use it. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like with mm-hmm. me, like with me, the music now is more about the content. You know what I'm saying? Like can like it's little kids that that gravitate to my music. You know, you know what I'm saying? Like, like my folks hit me up, like, yo, bro, like my my little my, my young boy love this song, bro. Mm, you know what I'm saying? That's dope. I'm like, I'm like, I'm like, damn, you know. That's a so, step like, right there, man. That means you're mm-hmm. doing something, man, especially if the youth embrace you, because obviously mm-hmm. the world is theirs, right? You know, I mean, they're mm-hmm. the ones that are coming up and setting the trends year after year, because every year there's another group of people that age out of it, right? That whatever was cool to them is no longer the move, right? So it's up to us to like kind of keep our ear to the youth or keep in tune with the youth because they're going to tell us what we need to know. That's how they get in the buy with all types of uh, crazy trick knowledge science out mm-hmm. here too. That's why you got to keep, you know, the youth in tune of the history of stuff as well and be like, yo, this is why we don't or why we're leery of this <coughs> or why we shouldn't do this. And then they can tell you why you need to adopt to new things, you know. Hmm? True indeed, true indeed. And I remember as you said something on the uh, True Head Live uh, podcast interview. You said that you rather have like the respect of one of these legends, a, a legend that you uh, um, was fond of or respected, you know what I'm saying, rather than a million dollars. Do you still feel that same way? Mm-hmm. I do, man. Like, like the bread, like the bread, like I said, man, the bread gonna run out. You know what I'm saying? But like, then, like, them stamps is gonna be forever. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Them stamps, like, like, them stamps can get you places money can't. You feel me? Like, mm-hmm. that's what, like, that's, that's why, that's why I say that. You know what I'm saying? Like, the money gonna run out. You know what I'm saying? It, it, what, what, what you gonna do when it don't count? You know what I'm saying? I, I, yeah. That's why I feel like that. Like, 
a, mil, a million, like the cost of living nowadays, a million dollars, that might, you know, how long, how, how long that's going to last? I mean, you can invest. You know what I'm saying? But still, you got to like, just like, just got, just, just like you got an upside, you got a downside too. Q&D. Yeah, Q&D. Oh. There's, a, there's a downside. Yeah, there's a downside to the legend too. Yo, meeting some of my heroes. I, I met several of, of my heroes that turned out to be dickheads. They was like really like, yo, I'm like, yeah. I'm, I, I don't know, man. I can't see these no, but, things. But having yeah, the respect, yo. but having the respect <laughs> of somebody that you admire know, and look I, up I, to I, is I, different. I, AK, I know, I know the feeling. My, I, I didn't, I didn't been there. Trust me, like I, I know, I know how that feels. You know what I'm saying? It is, it's, you know, it, it. But then you look at it like it, it ain't about nothing. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. You still, you still got motion. You feel me? They mm-hmm. probably don't right. Like they probably stuck like in the in the matrix right now, trying to figure mm-hmm. it out. You know what I'm saying? So I ain't. But I didn't, I didn't, I didn't have that happen before. Yeah, it just sucks, man. Mm. It makes you not not even want to get to know these motherfuckers sometimes. Like, yo, boom, like, for real, I, I like you better before I, 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 I said one word to you. Like, like it's a, the most beautiful woman you see in the world. You know what I'm saying? Then you take her back to the crib. You're going to get married. And you pull her panties off and it's doodle in her drawers or some shit like that. That's <laughs> like the, it's like, damn, damn, beloved. Like, thank, thank you for finding the five year old <laughs> analogy to that. That's awesome. And no, I mean that um, that would that would be that's, that's, that's real Holly pain Barry. right there, right yeah, there. Yeah, like that Holly is Barry, real like, pain. Dang, like yo, she don't I'm, watch I'm me. sorry. <laughs> I can teach Halle Berry how to clean her underwear. I'll, I'll do that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I'll deal Holly, with it. Single bed. <laughs> I bet you if you called her that for a week or two, she'd start cleaning up. Or she'd be like, what does that even mean? Probably. And that you smell that? That's what that means, beloved. You know what I'm saying? Word. Yikes. Yikes. Hey, hey, y'all, y'all cold blooded for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, man. Holly, your icon, man. I, I, I will find a way. And I bet she bathes, though. I bet she bathes. But yeah, meeting the heroes I'm and stuff sure a million she dollars. Does. I, get, I get that. Um, <laughs> The lo- yeah, <laughs> the longer I go in uh, this music lane, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I don't know. I'm still taking the million dollars, yo. You know how much Paw Patrol stuff I can get for my daughter with a million dollars? Hell yeah. I can buy a hell of a lot of Paw Patrol <laughs> stuff. Her birthday's Friday. Yeah. Everest, Rock, Marshall. I'm joking. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. That's Paw Patrol <laughs> characters. Yeah, yeah. But I, I definitely oh. do get the respect factor. If Doom was alive today, I don't know what conversation we would have, but yeah, if he said, yeah, you don't, probably, probably wouldn't believe him. him. Yeah, I probably wouldn't be believe probably him. get you man. Custom made. Custom made. I don't you know, know man. I, I don't know. Man, we, we, we see. I might punch him in the face. Custom I mean, made Paw Patrol, man. You know what I'm saying? I mean, yeah. Hell yeah. There you go. Yeah. You know, that yeah. million dollar the, the budget Paw Patrol. Yeah. <laughs> and maybe get a dog that really talked. I don't yeah, know, man. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> that you don't want a dog out. that can talk, bro. That's that's them people, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm on dust, man. I'm yeah, on, I'm I, dust. I, I, I rather, I rather, I rather have that stamp though, man. That's you know that's saying? a fact. Up, you man. can't buy it. You can't buy you can't, it. You can't, Not even. Yeah, or you can maybe you can buy it from Drake. Like, hey, Drake, I'll give you five hundred thousand right now to tweet my shit. All right, then I say he, he tweets sexy red. Then like boom, she blows the fuck up, yo. That's how that mm-hmm. shit work. And I remember you said it was all politics <clears throat> and stuff with jingle songs out there, oh, uh, man. in the mainstream. You know what I'm saying? I mean, jingle yeah. songs. Yeah, thing is having fun though. Know what I mean, it could be more detrimental than uh than to your uh serotonin to your brain. But um, yeah, it, I don't know. They're having fun out there, yo. Um. How do y'all feel about this um, J. Cole debauchery? You know, you know how I'm rocking. I ain't even. You ain't I, to I, it? I, I seen the headlines, but I ain't. I ain't even indulged, man. Like that was the best move. It. That was the best move, man. No pork on your fork, man. Keep it pushing, man. <laughs> that was a that was a bacon wrapped uh, hot dog. You understand what I'm saying? You didn't need. You didn't need no no parts of it. Yeah, that's a fact. Man. I think it's. Get I think dudes. it's. I think it's weird that you write a diss record, release it, and then apologize for it. 
Yeah. That's, that's that wet. just seems kind of corny to me, but you know, I mean, as far as I was concerned, it really wasn't that good of a disc record anyway. So that's what I was just about I to say. I didn't, Carl. Listen. I didn't listen to it. I didn't, I didn't listen to it either, but I know, yeah. I know for a fact, just based off of, uh, my guesstimations on the, the strength of J Cole as a rapper, that it was probably as hard as cotton candy. So I knew wow, for a that's fact really soft. <laughs> that it wasn't going to take no traction, but I feel like he ended up apologizing or doing whatever he coward move he did because it didn't hit the way that he thought it was going to hit. You know what I mean? He did. He was like, yeah, oh, I got something for this dude. And he came with it and, and it was fluff another man. You know what I mean? It was, <laughs> it was, it was a uh, styrofoam uh, pillow inserts. You know, it was nothing. And and he was like, damn, well, you know, I, I can't I can't claim victory here. But I mean, it was already the most lackluster. Uh, t- terribly contrived battle, quote unquote, battle that we've seen in a long time. It, I, I, I'm honestly I'm starting to think that it was fake. I feel like it's a, a, a publicity stunt pot- uh, potentially. Mm. Could be. I know, I know, Muskeen, you stay away from the mainstream. Uh, I'm all around everything, yeah. really. I, I'm, I'm all around everything. I don't think this is planned. I think the fact that this brother right here has been on a spiritual journey for the last 10 years, he actually likes Kendrick Lamar. He actually wants to do, they were going to do an album together. So he really felt bad about this, and he, that's what he said. So it came Sounds off with like some Cross soft Sounds shit. like a dork move. But I mean, Sounds like things that dork us. would say. It's the new NBA. Sometimes you like it, sometimes you don't. Know what I mean, nah, what? I don't like. I don't like LeBron. Man, LeBron is what? what Miss King, you don't like LeBron? I mean, he he's. I can't take nothing away from his game. You feel me? Like I, I don't. I ain't been in tune with the NBA in a minute. Mm-hmm. So indeed, yeah. I feel a lot of traveling. Traveling. Like I can tell you that. A lot much. Of, yeah, a lot of traveling, a lot, a lot of traveling. Flopping. Yeah, you know, it's it's oh, a yeah. lot of theatrics. Yeah, I ain't I'm out. I, see, I, 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 did, I did I did see that. I, I did see that. I think the other day, like, dude was like carrying the ball, like he had the ball in his palm for like ten seconds. Yeah. <laughs> then turn that turn that joint over, like dude looking at the ref, like hey, ref ain't even call it. You ain't see that? He Someone said, came up with the term Euro step and then uh, everybody I, decided you can just run around with the ball under your arm. That's illegal, B. That's illegal as fuck. Yeah, the but, euro step is dope when when it's done correctly, but not that not what we're talking about. See, the euro step was really Manu Ginobili. You know what I mean? South American step. <laughs> that's yeah. You know what I mean? It it that's where it really come from. Like Manu getting busy. Like that was the euro step. Um, so and did, then uh, what's his name? Tony lefty. Parker. Say who? Nah, I said lefty. Man, yeah, Manu, exactly. You know, you know, Ginobili lefty. Mm-hmm. Yep. Indeed. Yep. That's not. Yeah. Exactly. So that's another way that he got it off like that. But yeah. Shout either way, lefties. a lot of people are yeah. kind of just lazy to the lefty. <laughs> well, uh, you you le- you. Oh, you're Paul? a lefty too. You yeah. already. Oh, you know what I'm okay. I, ain't, I ain't say South Pole, man. Yep. South oh, Pole, love, man. I even got uh, my drum set up left handed. Like Jim Hall, you hear me? Right. Okay. Hey, okay. hey le- okay. like left handed people, like like. I don't don't quote me. You know what I'm saying? I I I really believe like left-handed people are like some of the most gifted people. Absolutely. Not saying like yeah. not not saying right-handed people like aren't, but like left-handed people, I I think like somewhere you probably get certain benefits for being left-handed. It's, like it's a connection to the creative side of your brain that, mm-hmm. that mm-hmm. right-handed people typically use more of the left side of their brain, which is the analytical side. Whereas mm-hmm. left-handed people use more of the right side of the brain, which is artistic. Oh wow, science. Huh. Okay, anti-dexterous people explain. like oh, myself. Hey, that that explains why those. I rap so much. Then you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. Like, well, I, guess, I, guess, I guess that's it. You hit it, eat bullseye. You feel me? <laughs> what up? My daughter left-handed. She do everything mm-hmm. left-handed, but we try to I like get her. it to use both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so shout out, shout out to Miss King and Carl, yo. Yeah, the le- the lefties in the building, yo. Boom, boom, boom. So, what are you into in your free time, man? I'm saying, boom, like, what you get into? <laughs> <laughs> man, excuse me, man. <laughs> hey, I caught you. 
<laughs> hey, I I just, you know, just try to put it together, man. Like, I, I just like creating. You know what I'm saying? Work out a little bit, you know, try to, you know, get get in, get in tune with myself. You know what I'm saying? Just like, I just like chilling, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, like just like, just being... You know, being being at peace, you know what I'm saying? Like just zoning out, create, whether it's rap, like try to put some merch together, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm 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 busy trying to like sharp like sharpen my swords up, you feel me? Mm-hmm. Indeed. Like 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 one like one way or another. You know what I mean? Indeed. Try to get the brand, get the brand, you know what I'm saying, tighten your brand up, you know what I'm saying? Because exactly. your name is a brand, you know what I'm saying? So absolutely. Exactly. Are you interested Excuse in me, trying to like do some sort of fashion or not fashion, but like specific type of merch? Are you like a shirt dude? Are you into like branded items? What you what you thinking of trying to do? Or what mm-hmm. are you doing? The rare form, man. Like that that's just like like just like just regular stuff, but like I, I do got like upscale ideas that I that I want to put together. You know what I'm saying? So like, you know, it's gonna it's gonna be a point in time where I ain't, you know, I you can rap forever. You know what I'm saying? As, like as long as like as long as God give you the, you know, the the ability to do yeah. so. But it's gonna it's gonna get to a point where you going to probably one step away from that. You know what I'm saying? So I want to have a merch. You know what I'm saying to, you know, for like further, you know. To like be like succeed, you know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. had 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 a merch. I I don't want to rap. You know what I'm saying? Like like I might invest in other people that want to do it, mm-hmm. but like as far yeah. as me, like I'm pushing the merch. You know what I'm saying? I'm pushing his gear like that. That's it. So indeed, well, well. Also, so one other thing. <clears throat> yeah, what what did the K Unlimited part of your name come from? You know what I'm saying? Oh man. You know what I'm saying? My 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 actual name is Cab, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? Okay. With a K. You know what I'm saying? Like Cab Calloway, but it's with a K. Mm-hmm. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So that that that's that's where the K come from in an unlimited. Like that's that's just like I like I, I got unlimited concepts in my head. You know what I'm saying? Like like my drive is unlimited and and mm. and in life period. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. That's, that's what I'm saying. Like, like if rap don't work, I'm, 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 I'm going to go to the gear. You know what I'm saying? If that don't work, like, I'll be a manager at Foot Locker or something. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> there's, a, there's a lot of stuff. By any know. means. Like, hey, man, hey, my, hey, listen, as long as I can be comfortable and do, and, and do what I like to do, nah, that's it. So, indeed. So, sneaker game is something you like, though. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. You know, I... I, I do. You know what I'm saying? Wow. I, I got cakes, man. New, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a New Balance junkie, though. Oh, okay. okay. I got some New Balances. Yeah. Joints, they, the, their new shit is fire. I don't know who the fuck went over there. To, uh, Joe Fresh Goods. Kinda, yeah, they, they really oh, yeah. stepped oh, yeah. it up. They, they, got a, they got a couple collabs, man. Uh, yep. Kawhi, action, action, Bronson, action, those, Bronson, those, yep. Those Johns is pretty, pretty hard, man. Yo, they like, are they tough. Got, they got a lot of collabs, man. But uh, yeah, yeah man, I, I, I deal with that with sneakers here and there. So indeed, so indeed, not too crazy, not too crazy though. So indeed, I'm looking at them right now. I just went on a joint in um, one fifty. Them joints is one fifty, G. For the Remember action I, I, 90, 60s, I forget, I don't, I don't know. That might be the, oh, the, the, yeah, the, the 90, the 90, the 90, the 90, the is hard. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's just, it's not, hey, they comfortable too. Like that, that's the thing about the new, the, the MBs, they, they comfortable, man. Yeah. The last ones I bought were 997s. Bro, I know what you're talking about. Those, 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 they, I think they got a couple collabs too. I remember um, they looked like the Air Dads when I when I was growing up. They looked like the Air the Mo- Nike Monarchs. They looked like those joints. I, I know what like, you're talking I'll, about. I'll never, I'll never you're wear these. About, yeah, 
talking yeah. about the nursing sneakers. Yeah, I know, I know what you're talking about, man. Yeah, the, the generic Nikes. Yeah, yeah, and then uh, uh, I got some Nikes. Did you say the hair hey. Nikes? Yeah, no, <laughs> no, I, I, I ain't seen. Them. I don't know. I thought that's what Primo Jab called them was the hair net Nikes. No, no, I called them the generic Nikes. Oh, like, generic. You okay. have you have some Nikes. I thought you were go. talking about some kitchen shoes. No, no, no. I play hey, the hey, basketball hey. tournament. Say it again. <laughs> no. Say it again. No, the, I played the basketball <laughs> tournament. The nigga niggas out there with the Nike Monarchs. I was like, hey, bro, you you bought those from your dad? <laughs> You got so bad. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that, I, I said, I said, no bueno, man. You, you open it up. You liable to nah. catch an injury. Got oh, yeah, to. he did actually. And don't it, say, I didn't hurt him. He did get hurt. He tried a Euro step and uh, he hurt himself, man. His he shoes probably, top. Yeah, dad, like his toes flew him. out of his shoes, man. Like, yeah, there's, high, there's yeah, like no socks. padding or. Arms construction placed into <laughs> it those shoes they're literally just like okay we're gonna put a bottom here and then we're gonna take some fabric and just peel it up across the top that's leather yeah great here's put some laces in done there's no structure no support to them things whatever well, man. you know but i mean if you're grilling apparently that's the ones you want though what's the your favorite sneaker? master tens well, what's your favorite sneaker though? One of give us like t- two of your favorite sneakers, Miskin, that you got that you that you that you like. Oh man, the uh, the Griffies. Oh yeah, I the, the Griffies. I think the I think they had the second one. The Griffies and the uh, uh, the Gary Paytons, man. Oh, the, the gloves. gloves. Yeah, man, the black ones, the black yeah. the black Jones, man. Those, black zip, the two. black zip ups, huh? Yep. Mm. Yeah, I hope they know. Those, I hope they know. Yeah, things, man. Yeah, I Good hope they know those fucking zip ups. They hurt my feet so bad, man. I was like, man. "Fuck, yeah!" But they was fire though, bro. They wasn't really the hoop in because they were their reissues. They weren't no, the, the original. The original ones that we could have had in high school felt great. But then we bought them again. They then they was like had all the cool colors. They were definitely not hooping shoes no more. Oil. Man, yeah, like, like you know, you know, Nike more of just the look. You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, <laughs> they not, they not come like, come like. You gotta, it, it's just crazy. But people Nike, used to, though. people used to ball in Chuck Taylors, complaining about your feet hurting. <clears throat> my feet hurt. My feet hurt, man. My feet hurt. Yeah. My feet hurt. Hey, yo, son, but LeBron, no. Kyrie's. KDs, they still are hooping shoes, yo. Th- those are definitely hooping shoes. No, they, yeah, my, my, my Le- I hate LeBron. But I, I hope in LeBron. Why, why? Yeah. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> no, I was going to say, why, like, why you hate him, though, man? Because he's that, he's that <laughs> dude on NBA 96 that you created in the game with all the hundreds and just you just made layups <laughs> in the entire game in the video game. Ain't nobody. Ain't nobody staying in front of that man. He kind of a goof uh, a little bit in real life, but he's a good uh, philanthropist, I say. Yeah. yeah. Look, he's a, he's a cornball. Yeah, he, yeah. Like, he, yeah, he, he gets, get, get people his money. He a cool dude, I guess, but he just too big. I ain't, I ain't with that shit. That, who stayed in front of LeBron? Nobody, yeah, really. I mean, nobody. It's, it's can't a take that charge. They got, yeah. they got... He only got Paul two George. Uh, Paul George ain't stay in front of LeBron. Paul George does stay in front of LeBron. Nah, I don't him, know. Man. Yeah. I don't know. I, I mean, I, I can't, like I said, I, I can't take nothing away from his game. You know what I mean? Like, man, I'm look, man, I, I, I've, the lore of the reasons why, why people <laughs> can't stand LeBron, I think it all goes back to <laughs> Everybody used to love LeBron. Anybody who hates on LeBron used to be a LeBron fan. Me included. I wasn't I, a LeBron fan. Well, <laughs> I'll tell you, I was definitely not when I say fan, I'm I'm using that as <laughs> I was eager to see his career progress into greatness. And when he came out as the high school player and he was fresh faced and 
eager to to go out there and do his best. Man, I was like, yeah, I was rooting for him. I was like, yeah, let's go, LeBron. And when they made it to the playoffs in the finals and, and LeBron caught cramps and quit <laughs> the game, he broke my wait, heart. Wait, what year was that? Uh, two thousand eight, nine. Oh, that's the Cavaliers. No, no, it was the Cavaliers. Cavaliers. This was on the Cavs yeah. because he he caught cramps the first time. Yeah, the first time he was on the Cavs. Exactly, Carl. He caught cramps. It was, water. Water. It, it was game four. It was game four, huh? And there was plenty of time for them to still come back. And he caught cramps and decided to sit out the rest of the game in the playoffs. And they lost this series after that. After right, that very game, it was a pivotal game. You hear this man blaming this dude for catching cramps? Yeah, but I'm not cramp blaming him that, for that. Uh, I'm there's, saying there's, there's another historical what player that would have never done that. There's, there's. I'm not even going to talk. But I'm not even going to talk about it. But I say all that to say that's one thing. And then you, then after that, that's the root. <laughs> that's the root of a sucker. Start the sucker tree started growing right then. Then the he did that tree. dumb, <laughs> that dumb announcement. I'm taking my talents to South Beach. Bitch, didn't nobody ask you where you going? I mean, just get a trade. Like the a money he raised for that when he did that went to the boys and girls club. He raised money when he did that shit. Yeah, but he didn't have to sound like a cornball when he was doing it. He did it. sound like a he dumb cornball. He did. He would have raised just as much money without saying that. But the New Balance 327s, I'm looking at them hoes right now. They're $99. Them shits is fresh. With the big N. Y'all seen them? The, the big N? Yeah. 327. I got to you. You're not going to get it shit? with your blur. You got the blur on. Yeah, I oh, can't even see. It looked like gangland, huh? Gangland, like, I, like, yeah. I, like I'm testifying. Like I'm YSL. <laughs> and I motherfucking don't want to see my face, huh? <laughs> So real quick, while we were talking about basketball. I just wanted to mention this real quick. Um, and, and actually, this is as much for Primo Jab as anybody. Um, did you hear that the creator of NBA Jam had actually built in that the Bulls couldn't beat the Pistons? What? In the programming. Definitely. In the program. Yes. What would happen is if you were playing NBA Jams as the Bulls, you could be dominating in the first half and automatically what would happen in the second half is your, your shots wouldn't go in. You couldn't hang on to the ball mm. and everything Detroit did was buckets, buckets, buckets. And it would, it would automatically make Detroit win. And the, the creator admitted it like in August of last year. Yeah. Yes. It was in the program because he was a huge Pistons fan and he hated the bulls. <laughs> and he hated Jordan too. Jordan wasn't even in the game. Yeah. <laughs> and then and then as a Pistons fan, he got to watch the Pistons totally fall apart as as the Bulls dominated in one game. So they got back to back, Paul. Take that. Yeah. Paul. They did do back to back. That's cool. And uh I mean, hey, it was a glorious time in basketball. <laughs> it was definitely a glorious time in sports in general. But you know, all that's distractions, man. Let's Man, forget about all that, yes, man. Let's yes. move on past that, man. <laughs> no, man. Let, so I want to ask more about Delaware and coming up in Delaware and, and repping for Delaware and what you see is the future for Delaware. Is there a future for Delaware? Like, let's talk about Delaware, man. Let's talk about your place in it. Three oh two. One of the the faces of it, man. Because, like you said, it's you, it's Jay Nice, all hair, white tee. Left lane, I didn't, D, know, I didn't know left lane was from like, there. I didn't know left lane yeah, was from there. Yeah, Holding it down. It's, it's serious. It's, it's, it's serious it's out there. Lord. Man, okay. It is, man. You know, like Delaware, Delaware as a whole, you know, it, it's, it's only it's only so so big, but yeah. it's a lot, it, it's it's a lot going on. You know what I'm saying? Whether whether you up top or down bottom, you know, around my way they got a uh, they the HBCU. You know what I'm oh, saying? Really? Del Del Delaware State. Delaware, Delaware State. State. You know what I'm saying? So you you got to think like, you know, people ask all the time, like, like what's going on out Delaware? Is it black people out there? You know what I'm saying? Like, like what, what, well, what's out there? Yes, it's, it's across like, from Philly, though. So I, I, I always thought Delaware was kind of close to Philly. So, or yeah, yeah, it's near Philly. Man, you got, and then, and then you got like going down, you got the DMV. You know oh, what I'm okay. saying? Going up. And then going up, you got the tri state. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, there but, you go. That's right. Yeah. 
but it's uh it's it's two it's two different like our tri state would be like Delaware, Philly, and Jersey. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and the other okay. tri state would be like Jersey, New York, and, and and Philly or whatever, or Pennsylvania or whatever. Yeah, in Pennsylvania. Right. And then there's what New York, Connecticut, New Jersey is another tri state. I mean, the tri state could be a whole different things, three bunches of different things. That upper uh, upper East Coast is wild up there. Mm. I, it's like everybody like two hours away from everybody. It's just dope. Man, yo, like it. So many people didn't slid through Delaware. Like prime example, Nas with the uh, headed for Delaware with one change of gear. Yeah, you know I'm oh, saying, wow. like, Shit. yeah, a, 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 like a lot of people slide through Delaware. Man, it, it's a, it's a lot going on out there. Yeah, you know I mean, like, but growing up out there is, you know, it it was it, 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 it wasn't it wasn't that bad. Yeah, you know I'm saying so. You know, till individuals got older or whatever, and mm-hmm. you know, you got like you got everybody coming from everywhere. You know what I'm saying? And and you know, it just develop over like over time. You know what I'm saying? But it's it's a, like you can do a lot out there. Mind you, it's, it's tax free, all that. So really, mm-hmm. I had no major. Listen, I Del- 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 Delaware is one of the. Uh, one of the, one of the best places to actually like uh like like start your business. I I think it's uh oh really no state yeah. tax right yeah yeah exactly. So I think it's uh Delaware and something oh, like right. Ida like Ida or oh, yeah it's like one of one of them crazy spots. But like Del Delaware like that a lot of people go through Delaware to like finance their businesses or whatever. Yep. Interesting. Okay, I feel I like I've no heard clue. that before too. I feel like maybe LLC's creation mm-hmm. or something. I feel like if you do in yeah. Delaware, you you you're really good on your taxes. You don't, like exactly, nice you, don't, you don't, yeah, you don't get the tax. Exactly, that's tax dope. Free. That's dope. See, okay, all right, yeah, man, we're gonna do some business in Delaware. I like that. Mm-hmm. That's 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 some game right there, yo. I just I just finished my taxes, you. man. I'm I'm trying to keep it on the straight and narrow, bro. So yeah, I'm trying to tie to LLC hey, out of Delaware. Hey, listen, I don't, right. I don't know. I don't know if they still got it, but For real, uh, Carl. <laughs> I know, I know, I know. You heard about Coachella, right? Yeah, of Coachella, course, yeah, it's happening right the, now. Uh, like, like out, like out, out my way in my city, they got the uh, Firefly. Firefly, yeah. yeah. Oh, that's out there. Okay, I, I didn't know that either, yo. Man, that, that's that's right there. I I think Never when I that. went, yeah, when I went, uh, Wes and and like Griselda was there. I think Lil Wayne. They had some rock group called the Killers or something. Yeah, you know what I'm saying it was, yeah, it was, it was a lot of people there. Hey, man, it was it, it's a lot going on out there though, man. That's what's up. What's, what's the dope? big city? What's the big city out there? I mean, I, I think Wilmington. Wilmington is Wilmington. Big. Yeah, I'm saying Dover but is where Dover, everybody at, right? Like, yeah, Dover, Dover is the capital. Yeah, okay. You know what I'm saying like you got Wilmington. Like Smyrna and then Dover, you know what I'm saying? Dover is like central Delaware. You know what I'm saying? Then going down, like you only got three counties, you feel me? Wow. So like, yeah. It's pretty small. Huh? One, and 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 one area code. Yeah, that's dope. 302. That's dope that y'all got the mm-hmm. same area code. Hey, hold on. Something else dope about Delaware that I do know about Delaware. Y'all, what's your license plate number? You got like one of the low license plate numbers, one of the high numbers. I, I know for whatever it is, mm. it's like y'all got to keep the same license plate forever, right? Essentially, when you get a license, it's you got that same license. So people really like covet like the low numbers and licenses because that means you you've been there for a long time or something like that. Is that I a did. thing, or am I tripping? No, I I think what it is like if you got the low license plate, I think those are worth money. Yeah, there you go. See, I knew it was something. I heard about it. Yeah, what, what, yeah. What you mean? I, I learned, it was money. What, what, I learned. What? I learned that the same. The, the same grandfather that took my tapes told me that. Mm-hmm. So oh, shit, <laughs> you got the so, chronic and shit. Yeah. So, Luki, the the way that and correct me if I'm wrong, Uskin. Uh, so, if in Delaware, essentially, when you when you get issued a license, when it's first started, a license plate, a license plate. Or a registration, vehicle registration, whatever it is, 
it it stays in your family, right? So and it goes in order. Like there's a license plate out there that's number one. There's a license plate out there that's number ten, number one hundred, number you know two thousand, whatever the case is. So people covet the the lower numbers because it's like it you know it's number one for the the novelty of it, but also it means that you've had it for a long time. Like it's it's prestigious, right? I mean that's at least that's the way I heard about it out there. I, I think I think you can buy one. If I, you if, can if buy them. I, I, if I if I ain't mistaken, like don't don't quote don't quote me. I don't I don't well, want to give you the wrong. I don't want to give you the wrong info. You know I don't mean? know. Like I said, I just know I just know license plates are special. We gonna Google it, man. We gonna figure it out though, man. Delaware license yeah, plates. Sure. Hey yo, that's a song, Joe. We gonna do man. Delaware license plates, man. <laughs> there it is. Man, man. That rare, that is rare, rare. You know what I mean? Rare flames, right there. Hey yo, rare. I'm still, I'm still, I'm still tight at your grandpa, but still on the chronic and and uh, thirty six chambers. Yeah, he, Two great albums, yo. You probably you listen to him though. You think you listen man. to him? Ain't no telling. Ain't no yeah, telling. That's dope. Probably, dope, probably not though. <laughs> yeah, probably my not. My grandparents wasn't into that, yo. They wasn't into that, yo. They was listening to, to uh, probably not the better type of music. My mom don't even get into that shit right there, yo. She listened to. Jealous type of fella and all that, all that type of good shit, yo. Can't front. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Word. Boom. Uh, I got a friend that lived out in Wilmington. Uh, Cami a vet. You know what I'm saying? I was like, yeah. I like. I didn't even was speak to the science of um, the whole entire state like that, man. So, yeah. Word. That's dope, man. Word. You see yourself yeah. living there forever? Man, I'm... I mean, I ain't even right there right now. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I'm, I'm on, yeah, I'm on the west. I'm, I'm out of Arizona. You feel me? Oh, oh shit! Nice. Oh shit! Kick yeah, it! I thought, I thought you thought you were still there in Delaware, Delaware yo. No, no, no. Yeah. I'm, I'm in AZ right now. Who else out there in Arizona that we know? Shit, man. Well, man, 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 doesn't live out there anymore. But Rob De Niro is still Florida. out there. I Rob think. De Niro, yeah. T Call, T Call yep. out there, T Call yeah. out there. Man, I'm out Phoenix with it, man. Yeah, Maricopa County. Yeah. Maricopa. Hey, yeah, Maricopa, yeah. Maricopa, man. Mm. Like, it's cool Stay out away here. from Tent City. My mom lives in Mesa for oh, a while. Man. Oh, Tent man. City? Yeah, yeah I, I, that's like, when I, when I got out of school, that was the first spot I went to, Mesa. Yikes. Man. That's what's up. Yeah, man. But that's where I'm at right now. But like, no matter where I go, I'm I'm, I'm 302 mentality. You feel me? Like, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. you know, we you know we we just we just move like that's 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 one thing about like Delaware individuals. You know what I'm saying? Like, it don't matter where we go. Like, we know how to that. You know what I'm saying some people like you put them in certain situations in certain places they don't know how to adapt because they stuck like they stuck in one mentality. You feel me? Yep, like man. like they stuck like they stuck in one frame of mind. You know what I'm saying? So whereas somebody like me, like it don't matter where I go. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. I'm like that. You know what I'm saying? It ain't it ain't it ain't, it ain't even the uh the, the the saying like what's that saying when you went wrong, do what the Romans do not nah, like yeah. you know, I I just I just you know, just learn to move and groove a certain way and and you'll be all right. Mm-hmm. And it's like but yeah, I'm, I'm on the I'm on I'm on the West Coast with it, man. Boy, that's a hell of a climate change, G. It is. It ain't is. no grass out there. Ain't no grass out there, right? Not like that. No, no. Nope. That's wild, man. It is. No water they be, for they be, you. You know what I mean? You used yeah, to coming they be, they from be the coast. A, uh, they be they be getting a, uh what is it, the astro turf? Yeah. yeah, the fake shit. Mm-hmm. Wow, how was that like? Uh, Adjusting to um, oh uh, the East Coast to the to the West Coast, like the first when you first got out there, how was that like? What, what was like? Man, I mean, it was it's it's, it's, to, it's totally different. You know what I'm saying? Like what 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 a lot of individuals do out here. Like you don't you don't really see like as far as like being in 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 in. In the in in the world out here, you know what I'm saying. Like as far as being like in in the street, per se, not like being outside, for should I say? 
Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like they like you know, this is all open carry state. Like like I'm mm-hmm. I'm like, I, like I'm talking about as soon as I moved out here, I'm I'm in the gas station, you know what I'm saying? Somebody in front of me, this dude got the ladder and, and everything. You know what I'm saying? Like out. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. He got the extension mm-hmm. out. And I'm, stick, I'm yeah. like like man, like where I'm like around my way, you like you're not gonna know somebody got it and I'm, <laughs> yeah. I'm, 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 unless exactly. it's on like like that and, and then just like the dynamics with like you know out here you know what i'm saying it's, it's more like you know latinos and and, and, and caucasian people you know what i'm saying that, that's, that's like the overall population out here you know what i'm saying so certain things that you know i do out here you know what i'm saying i like or, or certain things i did back home i can't do out here you know what I'm saying? So as far as that, you gotta learn how like learn how to adjust, like learn when to say it, what to say and how to say it and, and, and all that stuff. Like it, it's just different. You know what I'm saying? Like it's definitely a culture shock, you feel me? Definitely. But it's, it's, it's cool. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? My thing is like it's it, it's nice out here. You know what I'm saying? But at the same time, like it'd be a lot of bull crap going on out here too. Yeah, you know what I'm saying, and, and 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 what I mean by that is like, you know, somebody like me, you know, what I'm saying, if I get a nine to five, you know, I I, I look a certain way, or I, I you know, I, I got a certain demeanor about myself, uh, like off the dribble, you know, what I'm saying, you getting, oh well, he looks like this, he looks like so, oh like off the off mm. the dribble, you know, it, it's, it's different, so you just gotta adjust. Yeah, you know I man. So indeed, I, I definitely understand that it's culture shock for me when I moved to Atlanta. Uh, but it was a different type of culture shock. It was like every culture is down here. Every culture, instead mm-hmm. of just the two dynamics of like black, black and white people, it was everybody down here. So I definitely see when you move to Arizona, where you see just Latinos and Caucasians. It's a different type of Latino and Caucasian down there. Yeah, you know, man. In Delaware, and you don't have to have no coat, right? I, I mean, you got you got to you got to keep something on top. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's it, cold at night. It's it cold at night. It, 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 oh, it, it, yeah. It, 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 it definitely do. Hey man, listen, I'm gonna tell y'all. Like, I got I got a lot of family in the A, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I actually used to live in uh, Marietta. Hey, oh, okay. Motorola, right. Motor, Motorola. Yeah, but I got okay. I got family all through Clay Cole. You know what I'm saying? Fulton. Okay. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I used to, I used to be out there as a young man. You know what I'm saying? I know about that. Yeah, yeah. Well, me and Carl here, Primo Jab, about to relocate here in a second. But we be, we mm-hmm. we want to throw a festival out here too, man. So we we keep you informed about the Abyss Fest. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, we gonna try yeah, to get man. everybody out here have have a show. Maybe a three on three basketball tournament. Uh, I'm gonna smack a shit out of Ala Preen. Uh, oh all man, that shit. word that type of shit. Oh. Yeah, hey man, I I I, I, I can splash a little bit. Yeah, word, man, I, word. I used to get active a little bit. Well, 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 yeah, boom. I'm, I'm all, uh, Uh-oh, here we go I'm, again. I'm, 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 a, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a play ball against these umbrella niggas. You know what I'm saying? Where these umbrella niggas talking mad shit. And so is Finn. Oh, man. Yeah, so Finn from uh, uh, Brown Bag Money. You know what I'm saying? Golden Era Music. All them niggas. You know what I'm saying? Where, boom, y'all might be able to do a lot more stuff with music. But y'all niggas ain't going to beat me in basketball, man. Man, we going to have an epic tournament yeah. when it happens, man. Hey. It's going to be dope. A A A K A Lou, you you must be super nice, man. That's a, that's a heavy toll, man. I'm, I don't know. He's just chock full think, of bravado. Lukey's decent. Lukey's real <laughs> decent, man. Like I, I, I mean, mean, I know he talks. He talks a very crazy uh, platform, right? He pushes a, a heavy program of disrespect and <laughs> in uh, basketball, in, in basketball, basketball, in basketball. Of, of magic. And I mean, to be honest with you, he can he can back it up, man. He the man is nice. He got a he got a shot. Um, he can drive very well. Um, you know, obviously, all you got to do is just be big enough, and you can't and he can't get past you. So nah, you know, you can, he nigga, can pretty much have hurt me. I used it's, to be hurting niggas. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's ways <laughs> to stop him, but he's definitely decent. Like he, I, I'm not. Like I can't wait to see him play against half these people he's talking shit to. Like I really want to see him play against Sauce Heist. You know, so, yeah, obviously definitely. number one. Steve, That's number one. Steve, 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 Eddie Kane. 
Yep, I need to see. I need to see the all these games. Steve, oh, AK, they, I'm not scared of oh, they, 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 they get busy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah yo, I'm not afraid. There's of people Bizza. that get busy out here, man. Jr. Jr. Yeah, yo, Jr. I want to see Jr. come in this month. Man, I'm a, I'm a, I'm I'm gonna tell you, man. Like since we talking about you know rap, rap, like rap is that play ball, right? Yeah, I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you who I got to play ball with. That's super nice, bro. Oh, who? Louis, Louisville Slugger, man. From oh, really? yeah. Wow. Hey, hey, man. Listen, like he, he's, he's. That's that's a talented dude with that. With How that old is he now? Man. How old is he now? Man, I don't, yeah. I don't know, but he's probably he's like 30, 30, 37, 38, I would think. Maybe, yeah, uh, maybe a little. Probably better. He probably better than me then. Yeah, <laughs> oh, that's, that's dope. He, that's what's up. Yeah, he, he get he get, he get busy, man. I was like, I was I was shocked. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that, that's that's a shocking story to hear, though, man. But like, I always <laughs> love hearing like the crazy off the cuff stories. Like, oh man, you know who's a, a world class chef? Ice T. And you're like, what? He's like, yeah, he <laughs> made me he made me the most incredible fucking quiche the other day. It was, it was incredible. <laughs> and you're like, man. what for real? Like, yeah, Ice T <laughs> gets busy, but you know, yeah, you hear it. You hear about like these people that we only know for rhyming or making beats or whatever, and then you hear this other side of them. Like, no, they're actually they I do mean, this people. really well as well. Man, you know, that's know. dope. Yeah, I love I love hearing it, man. I yeah. I love the the complexity of of being a human, man. It's dope. He took it out, man. Just can go tell him he ain't touching me. He's forty seven. Yeah, he ain't. T- he ain't. Nah. He nah. Uh uh-uh. uh. Nah. Uh-huh. Nah. Hey, man. Smoke. Nah, I don't know, man. Nah. You know, you know what that sound like to me? That sound like uh Jake Paul talking to Mike. <laughs> I don't Ooh. know, man. I, I mean, I'm. Dude, <sighs> you, you, you just made, was, you just made me perfect. feel a certain type of way. You made me feel a certain type of way. You might have to line it up right. though. Yeah, you know I'm I saying we got to now. No, oh yeah, yeah. Got to line that up. Here's what it is, right here. I might, I might see if I can make that happen. No rest. Call your own fouls. Hey, yo, here's, here's what happened is everybody I will document I see is better. all of it we'll get it there you go yeah yeah <laughs> Mas- Mas- check it out I'm gonna see everybody play and everybody I think is better than me I'm picking all them motherfuckers to be on my team that's what I'm gonna do <laughs> yeah. man, we're doing we're tryouts so now for the event fest yeah this dude this dude uh, is ridiculous big trip, man big trip I'm getting people are gonna trip. have to send you in a hey, video submission a hey, son ain't gonna beat me a hey, son a hey, Eastwood ain't gonna beat me either cause he said he don't work hard on defense all these dudes but when we have this happening Live show basketball tournament, either three on three or five yeah. on five. It's gonna be you know dope. Saying? It's gonna be it's gonna be definitely, definitely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah, should we, be like two days. It. I, I yeah. already designated myself as a referee but because you talk so much. Oh, shit, I want to try to break your ankles at least you, once. I was about to say you ain't jumping in the mix, man. <laughs> oh, I can play. I can play. Oh, I'm, I mean, oh, I'm yeah. not like I'm not like league player or anything, but I can shoot. That's the first I time I saw him. And I definitely think I could fool I could fool Luki into breaking his ankles at least once. Oh, it's man. not gonna happen. The first time I seen Carl in real life, we was at a our, our work five on five basketball tournament. That's why I saw Carl. I looked at him like, look at this big motherfucker right here. He's like six two, six three. I'm like, yo, can you six, <laughs> six one? Yeah, he looked big though. And he, had, <laughs> he, had another, he had another dude on his team that was like six seven or some shit. That motherfucker was that guy trash, was in, though. indeed six four. Yeah, no, I was I how tall was he? Nah, I think he, he was 6'8". Yeah. Oh, okay, right, I was okay. like, yo, fuck him, man. Yo, fuck all these guys for this for this store. Fuck all these. I was, I was so mad, yo. We had to win that thing. We won that thing. But anyway, that's what we want to do. You know what I'm saying? So stay tuned for that, son. Uh, hey, yeah, man. We get you, yeah, yeah. We get, get, get you down here. I'm get saying, you on the stage. I'm, yeah. Hey, hey, listen. I, 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 specialize, I specialize in the ones, man. That's, that's all I'm saying. Like, mm. like, like, I'm only doing one on. I'm only doing personals, man. Mm. Yeah, okay. I'm just, if I, like, like, if I, like Wait, five, so? five is cool. I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just dishing out dimes. You feel me? Yeah, you know I'm saying. But I, I, I will splash though. Like, <laughs> like, yo, they, they, they used to, they used to call yeah. me Little Nick, bro. Little who? Oh wow, little, little Nick. Like oh, little Nick Van Exel. Van Exel? Yeah, exactly. Fuck's funny. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cincinnati. Like that. Nick like Van Exel like, was. He had that, the that's fire. How serious it was. I mean, I was like, I, I still, I still get it. I still shoot a little bit. But you well, know what well, I'm saying, well, like, well. man, I, I had a, uh, I had a little idea, a little three point, 
little three point shootout, man. We can definitely do that too. We we'll definitely do that too. Yeah. Hey. Well, well, hey, we got no, a trophy. Yeah, yeah. We have a trophy. That is, this is we have the ideas right now. You get the three point shoot contest. We can do king of the court too. Oh yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I, know, I know about that. Three dribble. That's, that's the that's that's the one and done, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. I played that yesterday at the gym with these young cats, and they was like, they yeah, was so I was just saying, that's a shorty game, man. That's the shorty yeah, play what, that game. What y'all be going to run and shoot? Nah, I don't know why. Out. I'm in a league on Thursdays. Okay. And with that, with that, that gym, yeah, that gym, they, they put one in the morning. But now I got a, a, a membership to Fitness Connection. And when I get off work, I go there, but I wear my work uniform. And so niggas don't want to pick me. I'm saying I'll be I'll be wearing my, my sneakers and I'll be wearing Yo, my long hilarious. ass. Yeah, I'll be wearing my long ass work shirt. And I and I walk up to these kids and be like, yo, you got me? And they'd be like, nah, I mean, I, I got four, but I'm waiting for someone off the court. And you got me? And they're like, nah, nah, I'm waiting for somebody. I'm like, damn, fuck these niggas, man. So then I finally get on the court and I'll be I'll be washing them. I'll really be literally wearing, wearing <laughs> this it. shit right here. With pants. With Nabisco on your shirt. Yeah, Nabisco. I'll be wearing this with pants. Like you got me, man. Hey, yo, can I can yeah, I hoop? Can I run with you? Can yeah, I run? Like, like, no, we don't, we don't here? know. We don't know, huh? <laughs> come back later. Yeah. And then you come out there and just start blazing. That's yeah, crazy. Shooting, out there shooting pull up 23 footers, knocking them down the court short. Man, yeah, I know people I, hate you, man. Yeah, I, be, yeah, I, believe, you. <laughs> I, be, I believe that. Is, is, that oh, is that the equivalent of wearing two tank tops and a pink baseball cap backwards? <laughs> huh. Not no YouTube shit. And I ain't painting my no, fingernails like that nigga from Duke. No, that's uh, white, white man, man can't, can't jump. jump. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, okay. There you go. My bad. My yeah. bad. We going to Sizzler. We going to Sizzler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, well, well. But check it out. I specialize in the paint. Even though I'm just 6'1", mm. I play like mellow. You know what I'm saying? So I get the oh, ball get and I turn and face. I turn and face to the mid-range. But now since I'm older, I don't want to work that hard, my skin. I don't want to work. I don't want to work to get open at all. So I'm just going to shoot that thing. You shorter than me, so- I'm just shooting. So you only you only play a half court? Nah, we playing full. I hate playing half court, really, unless it's king of the court. I don't like playing half court. I, I love playing full. I get full to court. get the ball, take like two dribbles, and pull it up on on a on a fast break, and that's it. But I if know, I get a man. rebound, I'm shooting it. <laughs> it 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 all it all it all depends on the energy level, man. They they like you got you got you got to be able to get up and down that court. I love it. Mm-hmm. I, lo- I, I be getting that's up and down. Part of the game, now. Transition yeah, I, I, is important. I love it. I I love it. I love, I love a whistle though as well. That's why I be in the league still. You know I'm saying I was about to quit, but then uh, I had a couple good games. No, I ain't gonna quit no more. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm back on my shit, man. You so ain't shit, Luki. Yeah, you right. I never been, and I never will be. I'm joking. <laughs> I'm a great dad. Anyway, Maskeen, what do we got to come up for you next? Or, what, what we got? What we got or, coming? What what you got coming out next? Or what we, what we got um, to get? You know, I'm I'm just I'm just in the lab, man. You just gotta stay tuned. I don't, I don't, I don't like to put it out there too early, but I'm you know I I took like I, I took them thirty days off. Like I ain't I ain't record nothing, so I'm about to go mm. back to the drawing board and mm-hmm. you know, I, I got a, I got a couple I got a couple jewels though. You know what I'm saying? I got a, I got a couple that I'm working on. You know what I'm saying? But the uh, the unlimited pack like that that's. That's, that's the freshest, the freshest drawn out right now. That's what we talking about. That's oh, what we like, yeah, bring, yeah, bring them over that way, man. Like, you know, but I, I'm, I'm definitely working though, man. So indeed, true indeed. So everybody mm-hmm. go out there and get it, yo, on Bandcamp. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? Bandcamp, Bandcamp. is on Bandcamp. It's, it's on all platforms. It's everywhere. So indeed. But you can go support mm-hmm. it directly. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's my thing. On I just want to be able to buy the Disney. Oh, yeah. Thing. So indeed. So we'll, okay, we'll, we'll yeah, uh, for sure. we'll go that, that, that physical. We got physicals too, man. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, the physical. The ITC. Oh yeah, you know yeah, I, mean? this, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that. I saw that. Yeah, yeah. that's dope. Indeed, yeah. They, they, that's they dope. good people. They good people over there too. The ITC. You know yeah. Hmm. Mm-hmm. So indeed. So indeed. Well, uh, mm-hmm. Carl, what do we got, bro? Look, I just you know I know we're we're kind of wrapping up, but I. uh I appreciate you coming on. I, you know, I didn't know you had started hey, any production. So for me, I'm really hoping that you'll dig more into that. Cause I think as a rapper and somebody that picks beats as well as you do, 
you obviously have an ear for it. So, you know, if, um, if you pursue that and keep, keep kind of digging into that aspect of it, even if the beats aren't just for your own rapping, I think it, it helps develop both sides of that craft. You know what I mean? Absolutely. Um, and, and, you know, when you were mentioning the, the passing on a million dollars for, for the respect of, of somebody that, that you respect, I think it speaks so highly of, of your passion for the art. So, you know, you can make a million dollars, you know, there's a way to make a million dollars, but you can't always Absolutely. earn that respect. And, and that's not something you can always control. So to be able to, to value that says so much to me about your character and who you are. So I just, again, wanted to thank you so much for just taking the time. And hey, out. man, I appreciate y'all, man. Triple salute, man. Thank what you up, what up? for having me. What, what, what? Thank you for shining the light that? over here on the floor, man. Yeah, you know I'm saying, Cage, man, keep doing your thing, man. Don't, you ain't don't, done. We're not done yet. Not done yet. But I'm not done yet. The court. <laughs> I'm, I'm always gonna hurt somebody hey. in the court. Primo Jack, what we got? Hey, look, hey, Mesquite, man. Like I said earlier, before, it's our honor, it's our pleasure to have you on here, man. Like you've been one of them dudes that's been putting in work, frontlining in this thing. You're part of this ecosystem. You're part of this brotherhood, this sisterhood, this family that exists and you've made an impact, man, whether it was rocking and, and collaborating with people that, you know, bless Picasso, geez, my man conspiracy, yeah, scary you hour. know what I mean? Spoda, yeah. Oh, yeah. you know, yeah. yeah, exactly. Scary hour, you know, all these like, but like I said, the names that you came up on when you was first just coming out, getting busy, man, you were coming out at a, a time when there were so many hungry ears. And not only were they hungry, they were finicky as well, right? So you were right <clears> there, standing shoulder to shoulder with the Griselda music that was coming out. You understand what I'm saying? And you were one of them names, man. So never forget that you had to go study up. You back now. You hit the ground running. It's dope to see that. Keep your momentum moving, man. You're doing great. Hey, it's it's just an honor to have you out here, man. Appreciate you, man. Thanks for taking some time I, to come check it, man. man. Yeah, no hey, doubt. Hey, listen, before I get out of hey, before I get out of here, right? Like, I just want to say, man, like it, it's on us to carry the culture. You feel me? That's right. Yeah, you know I'm saying, like, for like for anybody that know me, you know, what I'm saying it's a lot of individuals that know me and like that know me in this game. You feel me? Like, like yeah. it's, it's, it's 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 you're all a certified about the art, dude right? out here. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's all about the art, bro. Like, like we use use these platforms to, to, to build up. You know what That's I'm right. saying? Like, ain't, anything else is uncivilized, man. You know right. what I'm saying? Like, let's keep, right. like, keep that keep, part. Keep the culture moving forward, you feel me? Yep. You know what I mean? Just, but, but shout out to y'all, too, man. Like, keep keeping the art alive, man. Keeping the culture alive, man. Jab, like, like feelings mutual, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like you, like you, 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 you've been putting out jewels. Like you have been doing this for a little minute. You know what I'm saying? Like shout out to all of y'all, man. You know what I'm saying? Cage, man. You know what I'm saying? Carl, man. I, I see you with the art. I, I like the art pieces too, man. Thank you. You know what I'm saying? I, I, yeah, I appreciate y'all having me though, man. Like you know, let's let's keep let's keep on. You know what I'm saying? To build man. some more. We're gonna build some to, more. Definitely. Absolutely. Definitely. definitely, definitely, man. Shout out, yeah. shout out to everybody that's, as, as, as doing something, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shout out to everybody that's moving. That, that, that's, that's it. That's all it is. It's the form, man. Unlimited shit, man. Right. Mm. Mm. Like K K K K Live yeah, from K the abyss, man. man. You hear me? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 That's what's up, yo. Boom, boom, boom. Well, we thank everybody for coming through for episode 138. Issue yeah. episode, 138. episode 138. 138, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got we, yeah, we got 12 more to 150, you know what I'm saying? So we see y'all motherfuckers next week. Shout out to Ace Hood. See y'all next week. Wow. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs>